Rachel, and this is Dress to the Nines. Here we go with another fierce summer red carpet roundup. Supermodel Naomi Campbell turned up at a summer party in London looking incredible in all black. The 43-year-old donned a frock from David Coma's Spring 13 collection. She finished off the look with these killer Aliyah winged studded booties and some chunky rings. Love the bangs, Naomi. Apparently, they're all the rage right now. Anna Sophia Robb turned up in New York wearing a shirt dress from the Miss Wu Fall 13 collection. She looked fun and flirty in the black and white design. The best part of this look was definitely the awesome studded Valentino rock stud sandals. She polished off the look with a red clutch and matching red lips. Trey chic Anna Sophia. Starlet Bella Heathcote stunned at a gallery opening in LA this week. She wore a printed dress from the Mary Catherine Zoo Fall 13 collection. The Aussie beauty cinched her waist with a thin black belt and anchored the look with black Jimmy Choo Raven sandals. Bella Bella, want to get the look? Nine West has these awesome black strappy peep toe sandals called Memory. I actually have them in black and ivory and I can honestly say they are both chic and comfortable for those long summer nights. Now, I actually really want them in blue. So cute. Want to check them out? Click here. Get ready for Guess Who's Shoe. Which singer slash actress wore these black pointy pumps and mini dress that showed off her killer legs? Here's a clue. She used to be a Disney darling with an alter ego. It's Miley Cyrus. The future Mrs. Hemsworth wore this super sexy vintage Versace number to a radio pool party in Miami. Miley's really playing up her sexy new image and the straps and built-in choker give a nod to bondage, don't you think? I'm glad she kept it simple with her makeup and a black pair of Jean Michael Kazbat Emma pointed toe pumps. Not sure how I'm feeling about the new Alterna Miley. What do you guys think? Let's show them who's boss with our Shoe Queen of the Week. All hail the queen! This week our Shoe Queen is Naomi Watts. She looked better than ever at the Directors Guild in Hollywood. The Australian stunner wore head-to-toe black at the premiere of her man's new show, Ray Donovan. She was a knockout in a leather Alexander McQueen dress and black Sergio Rossi Oblo sandals. This is such a departure from her usually demure and classy looks. It fits the vibe of Ray Donovan, though. What a hot new show. Congrats, Naomi. Speaking of knockouts, our shoe shock is a blind left hook. We were in shoe shock over Hayden Panettiere's look at the Giorgio Armani Spring 14 show in Italy. Joined by her boxer boyfriend, Vladimir Klitschko, Hayden looked good in head-to-toe Armani until you get down to the shoes. I'm a big fan, but these silver slimbacks with gold accents and tassels are just all wrong for her. She should stay with her normal super high heels, especially when she's out with her super tall man. We have a runner up to our shoe shock this week. She's a repeat offender, Maggie Gyllenhaal. The actress wore a mixed pattern black and white dress from Christian Dior's Fall 13 collection. She wore it with black pumps as opposed to the runway look, which featured brighter white ankle strap heels and a higher hemline. I think Maggie needs a good seamstress because the lower length leaves her boxy. The look was a bomb, just like the movie White House Down. However, not to be too harsh on Maggie, she did have an awesome showing this week at a Gotham Magazine party. She looked young and sexy in a black Dries Von Noten dress with feather detail on the skirt. This dress makes those black Cassidy blade pointy toe pumps look fierce. Nice one, Maggie. Well, that's it for now. Check back next week for an all-new summer episode of Dress to the Nines. I'm Rachel. Bye. To see more Dress to the Nines and other awesome programming for shoe lovers, make sure to subscribe to Channel 9.